I guess in this video I am going to discuss about to Oracle client not found in Toad software. So when I am going to click here Toad for Oracle. So at here I am getting the error message you have no Oracle client installed. So this error comes because at here I am using Oracle or Oracle 11G64 bit operating system. So let's see at here SQL plus So at here let's write system system So see at here I'm using currently Oracle 11Z and 64 bit operating system So sometimes in some software of Toad doesn't support a 64-bit operating system. So we have to do one thing. So we have to download Oracle Client 32-bit software. So add here. So here I'm going to download. So I already downloaded Oracle 11G 64-bit operating system. So add here I'm going to download Oracle 11G 32-bit operating system here. So let's click on setup. So at here, give the or uh, Clover database name or here one because or here already exit. And here give the password. So now let's click on next. Yes. And you have to click on finish. So this will take some time. So now I'm going to pause the video. So let's click on allow access. So right here click on OK. So at your Oracle need configuration assistant or uh, failed. So don't worry about this. So let's click on next. So so at your the installation of Oracle database was successfully but to some configuration assistant friends. So let's click on close. Now here after so let's close that. And here after click on Toad for Oracle 9.5. So now here after see SQL or uh, a need editor. So it's a uh, uh, at here gradient signal. Now here after let's uh, click at here. Give the username. So, so username HR and here give the password HR and here select the database. So it's uh, not saying anything. Now let's click on direct and here after host. So give the host name localhost and here port. So if you are using at your Oracle 11C, so you have to give the port 1521 and here after service name or CR. Now here after let's click on connect. Click OK. So see at here it's connected successfully. Now click on OK. Now here after so at here let's see the records inside the table so at here select a star from so i'm going to select at here employees so see at here all the records it's uh, displaying here so this is the record inside the employees table so it's now displaying so this is the way we can fix or told Oracle client not find. So I hope this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.